stick with a constant urge to clean your hands, doorknobs, or backpacks. It's OCD, obsessive compulsive disorder. It affects about 1 million kids in the U.S. New this morning, 9 on your side's Lisa Smith tells us how one local child is overcoming OCD with inspiration from a baseball hero. 71 years after Jackie Robinson broke the color barrier in baseball, his impact continues on kids like Nate Heck, who has obsessive compulsive disorder. I've had that for a few years and I just feel like it was like the perfect thing to write about. He stated things very clearly and really put his heart into his writing. Yesterday was a big day. Nate is one of 10 national winners of the Jackie Robinson Breaking Barriers Essay Contest. He won a laptop after writing about his battle with OCD. In fifth grade, I didn't have many friends because of it, because I couldn't really have any time like to like, hang out with friends. And like I, like, I felt scared because they would touch stuff. He had a rash on his arms from here down. We took him to the doctors because we didn't know what it was at the time. Um, you know, looking back, we know now that it was him washing his hands excessively. OCD impacts about 1 to 2 percent of children, and there are certain symptoms that parents can look for. So for him, it was a lot of contamination fears, touching doorknobs, touching desks at school or things that other people had touched. But he's made a lot of progress. Now he wants to share his story. Try to spread awareness for all OCD um, victims so that they don't get made fun of and and they don't like get like, yelled at and like just the same way as Jackie Robinson was. Lisa Smith, nine on your side. Good for Nate. You know, OCD is a chronic condition. It comes in many forms, and Nate's parents credit Cincinnati Children's Hospital with much of his progress over the last year. And they say since writing the essay, Nate is more open to talking about his OCD.